Witajcie kochani, z tej strony płotka, my gramy w The Wolf Among Us. Zaczynamy trzeci epizod, nosił wilk razy kilka. Ostatnio skończyliśmy w momencie, w którym okazało się, że siostrę Holly zabił Crane, tak? Dobrze pamiętam jego imię? O, ten pajac tam, zastępca burmistrza. Zobaczymy, jak sytuacja rozwinie się dalej. Niestety tutaj gra czasami mi się przywiesza przy wczytywaniach danego, danej sekwencji gry, więc musicie mi to wybaczyć, nie mam na to wpływu. Our stories used to be so simple. We had a beginning, a middle, and an end. But ever since we moved to this awful city, everything's gotten so confused. Look, I didn't kill anyone. And I'm supposed to just believe you. Snow. I just want you to be careful. I almost lost you once, and... I'm not yours to lose. I'm not going to be an errand girl for Crane anymore. She looks like Holly. It's not Holly. It's her sister, Lily. She was hooking to pay down debt. Eventually, the only people she owed were at her work. You know, that shithole club, the pudding and pie. My name is Nerissa. Well, Nerissa, I've got some questions. The open arms. Oh my god! What is it? <gasps> it's Crane. No, jestem ciekawa, czy uda nam się go dorwać, chociaż on widział nas w lustereczku. Jak to odkryliśmy, więc podejrzewam, że zdążył już się ewakuować. Okej, okay, wilkuj, co teraz? That fucking creep. Spineless little fucking rat. Crane? Ugh, God, you think you know a person. Bigby, you have to tell her. I know. What's going on? What did you find up there? You know, other than the... I just need to find Snow. Why? What's going on? Shit! The crane's been... Uh. Oh, Bigby, calm down. Everything's going to be fine, okay? It's going to be fine. That perverted little fucker might be after Snow. I need to find her right now. Okay, it's it's going to be okay. Where did you see her last? Did she say where she was going? She took Holly to the business office to prepare for the funeral. Lily's funeral? Yeah. How do you know? I was just at the trip trap, and I heard Gren telling some folks about a funeral at the Buckingham the Bridge. Trip trap? Are you drinking? When? Right now. They were on their way out. Big B. Wait. Co znowu chcesz? Idź do męża. What? Snow's... Snow's been through a lot. There are things she doesn't talk about. Just... Please be careful. When you tell her. What are you trying to say? You know how you felt when you saw that picture? Well, it's going to be much worse for her. Just remember that. Okej, okay. będziemy delikatni. Z Holly nam się udało, więc myślę, że ze Śnieżką też się uda. Tą drogą jest ciekawe, czy do tego trip trapu chodzą tylko baśniowcy, czy do Cześni też. Okej, okay, udało nam się dotrzeć na miejsce. 
Rozumiem, że nie pochowają ją, znaczy jej na cmentarzu. Lily. Jakiś, nie wiem, plac budowy czy coś? Ta. Okej, okay, moi drodzy. Chodźmy jej poszukać. Lily had many friends, but few fables she was truly close to. If you are here, then you were part of a very special circle. People she trusted and cared for. I won't um, offend you by claiming one day that that the pain of losing Lily will ever subside. I know as well as you that it will never subside. But I also know that that the memory of Lily will sustain as well. I'll miss worrying and about will, you. In time, I'll miss our fights. Equal in strength I'll miss you. mourning her loss. Holly. And it is in that spirit that I'd like to talk about what you've all been so grateful to share with Now me. you will never die from indifference or lead a tedious life. Stubborn and Goodbye, fish. sweetheart. Rash Thanks for thoughtful. everything. How she carried Vivian. a torch for the old ways, for tradition, for um, pageantry. And most of all, you were a big, bright, sad. shining star Lily in this shithole of a town. Her and I miss you already. She Man. loved being around them. I never to, met Lily, what I've been told, Gorzała. I know in go. my heart that she would have liked to be here tonight. And now we'll have our um, okay, moment of silence. Thank you. No, ona się skończyła gadać i myślę, że teraz możemy z nią porozmawiać. No chodź tu, głupia rudo. Muszę z tą pogadać, kurwa. I'm sorry, Snow, but we have to leave. Not right now. No, you don't understand. Bigby, is everything okay? No, not you. Holly, it's... He wasn't fucking invited. Holly, wait. He has no right to be here. No, not after there. what he did. Holly, I'm sorry, but I had to come. You throw my sister down the witching well, and you have the nerve to show your face here? So? After you lie? After you promise me? Holly, wait. That was Crane. Just Crane. He disposed of Lily's body before Big B could do anything about it. I'm telling you the truth. Don't cover for him. But this genuinely wasn't his fault. You can't tell me Big B gives a shit about this. I'm sorry, Holly. I, I didn't know he put her down the witching well. Bigby cares, Holly. He's trying to help. And I'm sure he has a very good reason for being here. But this one isn't on him. Why are you here, anyway? And don't say it's because you care about this. Everything okay? I think I know who murdered your sister. Who? Maybe we should talk about this somewhere else? What? No, I deserve to know. I know, I... I know, but... This isn't the way to go about this. I don't give a fuck about the way. I don't care about procedure. If anyone should be told, it's me. It's yeah, us, right, right now. I think it was Ichabod Crane. What? Crane? Crane. Okay, everyone, just stop. Bigby and I are going to have a little chat while everyone else gets back to the funeral. What? He says that fucking Crane murdered Lily and you expect me to- Please, I promise I will tell you what the hell is going on just as soon as I know there's something to tell, but just let us do our jobs first. Look, Holly, Holly I know this how this is must No, you don't know how this must feel. You have no idea. Don't fuck anything up. Don't bother anybody. And when the first sign of trouble comes, and it will come because you're a goddamn walking trap for it, I want you the fuck out of here. You hear me? I just want to get Lily's killer, Holly. Nothing more. 
Let's just continue, okay? This is such total fucking bullshit. Let's go, Holly. It's your turn to talk. Green, czy tam Gran, weź ogarnij. Crane. Yeah. I can't believe this. This is someone I've worked with for decades. This is a guy... He gets freaking shakes when he has to order food. I mean, what are you telling me? It, it's all an act? Just, what have you found? Pigby? I followed a lead to this shithole motel, the Open Arms. Crane had a room there, and he's been taking prostitutes, or at the very least Lily, and making her look like you while he was... You know, the bed was covered in blood. I know it was him. This is... I don't even know what to say right now. I really don't... Wiem, czy I'm delikatni? just trying everything I can right now to not picture it. I'm sorry, Snow. And I'm sorry I had to be the one to tell you. You're sure this is what happened? This is what he's been doing? Because yep. please, Bigby, don't confuse things. Deposing Crane would be the next step. I thought you trusted me more than that. I do, but you've got a hot head and a big heart, and sometimes that's not the best combination. Look, let's go back to the business office. I doubt Crane's there at this hour, but we need to talk, and this isn't the place. Snow? Marissa? What is it? I'm sorry, but Holly's asking for you. Are they starting the burn? Yes. Everyone who spoke should really be present for this part. She's kind of distraught. You're not leaving yet, are you? Two minutes. I don't mean to be... Um, no, I understand. No, I get it. Take your time. It won't take long. How'd it go? At the motel? Did you find anything? It was Crane's room. But you knew that already, right? So, good job. Nerissa! Yeah, um... Uh, coming! Idzieć. W ogóle dlaczego one pracują jako prostytutki? Są takie... Wait, 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 easy now, girl. You know how this goes. The first thing in a visit, you say, how do you do? How do you do? Now is really not the time for whatever you jergovs are planning to do. Well, isn't that the thing of it? Plans. Except it isn't our plans you should be concerning yourself with. We'll hey, slip to the chest for all sakes. A little bird told us that you're fitting to go after Crane. And you see, we have an interest in that particular boy. So you leave Crane alone, and we'll leave you alone. Just take a little vacation is all. Don't even have to go anywhere. You're trying to pull this shit at a funeral? We can deal with this later. No, not later. Later's too late. Right now. So what's it gonna be? We have a deal? You leave Crane alone, and we leave you to yours? Brother? Just don't hurt anyone, D. That don't sound like a yes to me. Always wanting to do things the fun way. Ladies, gentlemen, invertebrates, please, rest easy. This is not... What the hell is going on? What's happening? Very sorry to impose, but we only had a deal to work out with Bigby. And we're unhappy to report that things did not go as smoothly as planned. Bigby, what is he talking about? Never you mind that, it ain't any of your... What deal? Settle down, settle down now. They want me to leave Crane alone. Crane? Oh, now you shouldn't have done that, old boy. Really. That wasn't right, telling everyone our dealings. What did I tell you? What did I say? Holly? 
Think you motherfuckers can come here uninvited? You think you can just fucking interrupt Lily's funeral? Calm down, darling. It's just a simple business transaction. You fucking freaks are not getting away with this. Holly, don't move. It's not worth it, Holly. They'll leave on their own. Yeah, let's spare all the fuss. It's just a dead hole. I'm gonna kill you! Yeah, green, green, green. I got it done. Dwa mać! No super, po prostu zajebiście. A ty dokąd? Aha, myślałem, że biegnie za nimi. I chuj, zabili tą holi, co? Ja jebie. O co tutaj chodzi, no? Hmm. Trochę nie bardzo wiem po co robią ten wstępnik, tak? Czy no rozumiem tak jak seria, ale trochę mnie to wybija z rytmu tylko. Niedobrze, niedobrze. Nie wiem, no już bardziej delikatnie chyba nie potrafiłem tego rozegrać. No ale cóż. Zobaczymy jak sprawa potoczy się dalej. Teoretycznie moglibyśmy się zgodzić, ale też nie wiem, jakby to dalej wyglądało. No i Holly i Gren nie chcieli nas zaatakować, tylko ich, więc chyba nie jest tak źle. Szkoda tylko, że ona nie żyje. Holly pewnie. To pewnie ten lekarz I did as well as I could to take out the buckshot, but there's still some shards left embedded in your shoulder. They'll eventually worm their way out on their own, but until they do, you're going to be sore. Big B, Dr. Swinehart was appointed Fable Town physician for a reason. It's okay. There's only one thing you have to take away from all this. Take it easy. Yes. Oh, the mom clock. Don't go looking for any more fights. Keep strain off your heart. How's everyone else? They all make it. They're fine. I had everyone that got wounded sent home. Holly refused to let me see where she lived, so I left her and Grendel back at her bar with a dose of juniper and spring water. The Titans, Bigby. They'll be fine. Just remember what I said. The stitches won't hold up if you continue to act like you normally do. No, me in moderation. And uh, eat more chicken. Your blood pressure's through the proverbial roof. I'll try to. All right then. Very good. Okay, czyli Holly jednak i grężyją. Czy nie jest tak szla? I know. I'll have to call you back. The town is starting to find out. Well, I'll leave you two to it then. Miss White, Big B. Ciekawe jak wygląda na serio doktor Świńskie serce. So, to recap, Crane watched me through the magic mirror uncover his room at the open arms, and then he smashed it so we couldn't use it ourselves to go after him. And we know this because Buffkin was drinking in the rafters. That about cover it. And once he puts all the pieces back together, it'll be easy to catch Crane. So, I guess that's the plan currently. But I, I don't know. There's no other leads. This is it. Just wait for the mirror. Yeah. To what the hell is going on? Just... I don't know what the Tweedles get out of this. I don't know if Crane sent them. I don't know if... I mean, this is gonna sound crazy, but... 
Do you really think Crane did it? Everything points to him. I get it. But do you really think he killed those women? He killed them. And he sent Dean Dumb to slow me down. He's... He was a conniver. A, a coward. A liar. And I'll always hate him for that. And I'll hate him for how he... held me in his thoughts. But murdering prostitutes? Ow! Everything okay over there? Yes, Miss White. I just cut myself on a piece of the glass. Nothing to worry about. Thanks for tonight, by the way. That could have gone really terribly. I mean, even worse than it did. I just feel bad for Holly, really. Yeah. Time heals everything eventually. At least, I hope so, for her sake. Can I, um ask you a question okay but I it's kind of personal okay and I don't want to offend you sure it's just when stuff hits the fan like like it did tonight it feels like before we came to the city it feels kind of like home and I've heard it said that maybe in some tiny little bottled up way deep inside you kind of enjoy it when things go wrong. Because it gives you an excuse to just, you know, stop pretending. Fuck no, I don't enjoy it. Are you kidding me? It's horrible what happened tonight. I wish it didn't happen. I shouldn't have said anything. Forget that I did. Uh, guys? We have a problem. What is it? I can't finish the mirror. It's missing a piece. What do you mean, missing a piece? Yes, it's, uh... It's not here. Buffkin, are you positive it's not here? Maybe it just slid under one of these cabinets. No, I'm sure it's not here. I checked every corner. I saw Crane pick something up after he smashed it. I'm sorry, I didn't realize what it was until now. Well, the mirror can't work unless it's whole. Well, that's not entirely true. Or what, Buffkin? What? We sit around and wait until it mends itself? We have no idea how long that will take. We're just gonna have to do this the hard way. I'm just saying, waiting is an option. No. We can't depend on the mirror. All right. How long will it take for the mirror to reform? Well, it could take days. Or months, or years. He had to have left something that tells us where he's going. He's a neat freak, but he was never that smart. Smart enough to take a piece of the mirror. We can still solve this ourselves. I know never that Never mind that. Come help me look. Dlaczego lekceważycie Bawkina? Może chciał powiedzieć coś pożytecznego? Pomocnego. Pogadajmy z nim. Hi, Mr. Bigby. I can still help you catch Crane, you know. Oh, yeah? Yes. I saw him jump on the telephone before he left. He called up somebody. He said he needed to see his witch, or that he would need to get to the witch for that. Whoever that is. His witch? Yes, it sounded like the one he got his snow glamours from. Hmm. Look, uh, the whole mirror thing, it's not your fault, right? Y you mean it? Yeah. You didn't see anything else, did you? No, not, uh, not especially. Why didn't you try and stop him? What do you want me to do, yank on his hair? I'm only three feet tall. There are limits here. Okay, okay. <laughs> I'll just see if I can do anything about this. You do that. Lampy podszyć nie możemy. Czy mamy tutaj coś jeszcze na stole? Biurko Kraina. Sprawdźmy co ma w szufladzie. Książka. Cóż to za książka? Hmm. 
-hmm. There's a page here that was torn out. Oh, yeah? Buffkin, do you know what was here? It's a ring, at least. Every magical item not retained in the armory is assigned to someone in Fable Town. It must be this witch he is going to see. Wait, what witch? Buffkin overheard Crane set up a meeting with a witch. Well, yes, it sounded like the one he got his, uh, you glamours from. It must be about this ring. Why not mention this before? No one asked me. Buffkin! And I'm hungover. I'm sorry. <laughs> we set the meeting at 2 a.m. Tonight. Okay, so... What's so going on? Info. Is the mirror fixed yet? Bluebeard, this isn't the time. Is the mirror fixed or isn't it? You called me I Rita. called just to see if you knew where Crane could be, and that was it, okay? And I'm sorry I said anything more than that. Well, you did, and I know. The cat's out of the bag. So, can we find the dull pervert or not? I tried this to, but... This isn't your concern. No, it can't be fixed. It's missing a piece. This is none of Bluebeard's business, Bigby. None of my business? Crane's the murderer. He escaped. It seems he spoiled your every attempt at locating him. And now it's but none of my business? We don't know if he's the murderer. Oh, please. Of course he is. Look, this just isn't the time. He took a piece of the mirror, so we can't use it. The only thing we know is that Crane's going to see a witch at 2 o'clock. A.M. or P.M.? A.M. Listen, Bluebeard, you're not a part of this. I don't think you're in any position to turn away help. Why do you even care about this? Why? I'm invested in this enterprise we call Fable Town. <laughs> Literally invested. Since it's mostly my money that keeps the whole thing running. Ah, no, tak to pieniądze, oczywiście. Crane has been killing fables, and there's no system in place to catch him. Look, we know that Crane is going to see a witch, and it's to acquire a magic ring. What's the ring? We don't know what it does or who it's assigned to since Crane tore its page out of the book. This farce was your ridiculous idea for a plan. Who put you in charge in the first place? Fixing the mirror was the most logical You're thing. You're a secretary. He's the sheriff. And none of you were chosen to run this office. Who elected you to make these decisions? Nobody, but that Who doesn't... elected her to spend my money? Well, I've been doing that unofficially for years. I'm heading up the investigation, okay, Bluebeard? That makes this a moot point. And somebody needs to run the business office while he does so. No voice. Well then, excuse me for having the Commonwealth in mind. All right, let's just look on the bright side. We know Crane is going to see the witch that's been supplying him black market glamours. Thanks to me. And that he'll be there at two. So that gives us a few short hours to find out who it is and where they live and get them all at once. And a few shorter hours the more you babble about it. We haven't been the ones babbling. Yeah, yeah. Just point in the direction you want me to check first. Since Lily used the glamours, she'd have known who the witch was. And I don't think Holly's burned her things yet. It would probably have the address or a phone number or something. And Bigby is free to go there if he likes. But I think the question you should be asking is just what do the two Tweedles know about this? It doesn't matter what they know. After tonight, they never go to their office. They're not smart enough to try and go anywhere else. The Trip Trap is the better option to track the witch down. If Holly has Lily's things, that'd probably be the safer bet. I don't really care what you two do. I'm going to his apartment. What? You can't just go up there. Then why the hell not? We already looked for the key, remember? I don't know where it is. Then I'll pick the blasted lock! <sighs> I've wasted enough time waiting for the mirror to find him. I won't waste any more. You just can't go up there alone, all right? I've no interest in nicking his drapes, my dear, if that's what concerns you. <laughs> what concerns me is you traipsing through possible evidence. Oh, now it's evidence. Before you had no interest, and now it's a crime scene. Fine, I don't care. Just go ahead. We can't just let Bluebeard run amok in Crane's place. Ha! He's after something. I just don't know what it is. We have to find the witch, Bluebeard, since that's where he's going. Or the sniveling weasel chickened out. Never went anywhere, and is upstairs right now in his pitiful penthouse, crafting a fort out of couch cushions. 
Look, this is how a smart person would do it. So this is how we're going to do it. Wherever you go, I'll go to the other. I don't like you going anywhere unsupervised. He's up to something. I don't know what it is, but we don't have the time to really worry about it now. Where are you going to go, Bigby? Let's go to Lily. Okay, we have to go to the So you leave Crane alone, and we leave you alone. I'd love to join you, but there's some business I need to attend to. No, no, I'm better off dealing with things alone. I don't need sympathy, and I don't need charity. The witch's identity must be with Lily's stuff. I should go see Holly first. Perfect. And I'll go to Crane's apartment. I'll check in with you later. I hope you know what you're doing. Robimy to na czuja, my dear. Okay, my dear. So tutaj nam zapisze się gra. Myślę, że w tym miejscu zakończymy pierwszy odcinek trzeciego epizodu. Jestem ciekawa, jak tutaj cała sytuacja dalej się rozwinie. No dalej już ładuj się. Nie wiem, co ta gra tak długo się ładuje, to... Tylko przygotówka na się ładuje i ładuje. Okej, okay, moi drodzy. Ja tutaj e, zakończę ten odcinek. Mam na nadzieję, że odcinek Wam się podobał. Jeśli macie jakieś uwagi, to oczywiście zachęcam do pisania w komentarzach. No i cóż, trzymajcie się ciepło i do usłyszenia niebawem. Cześć!